Are you concerned? Yeah, absolutely. This is a very dangerous problem. Stop vaping. That's the message from doctors as they try to figure out why so many people are starting to come down with serious breathing illnesses. And Katie, of course, vaping is very, very popular right now, especially among young people, but it is also very dangerous. And here's what we know so far. Uh, in the U.S., they have already had 450 illnesses that have been reported. Nine of those are in Louisiana, and local doctors tell us some are in this area. Four people in the U.S. have died, according to CBS News. Now, health officials say no single vaping device, liquid, or ingredient has been tied to all of the illnesses. But Meg Ferris reports on why doctors are so concerned. There are bilateral fillings. When LSU the health spaces, pulmonologist Dr. Stephen down. Cantro looked at the lung scans just published by the New York Times, he knows something is wrong. This is a very dramatic um, abnormality of the CT scan. Doctors throughout the U.S. and here in Louisiana are trying to figure out what's causing so many young adults to have such acute lung damage after vaping. One of the concerns is that empty cartridges we found easily online are being filled with all types of different oils from vitamin E to marijuana. There's been evidence of oil in lungs on biopsies for many of these people and vitamin E could easily be part of the story. So that's the problem with this uh, is that you don't know for sure what you're doing. The best is not to vape. The Louisiana Department of Health is asking any doctors who have seen lung damage potentially from vaping to report it so the CDC can study what some are calling an epidemic. The state epidemiologist says young and middle-aged adults across the U.S. and right here in Louisiana are getting unexplained patterns of pneumonia without any evidence of a bacterial or viral infection. And all at once, either they are a chronic disease, they start having uh, pulmonary problems, cough, shortness of breath. We talked to people who work in a vape store who told us off camera they believe regulated products like Juul and Juno are safe and that it's the synthetic, homemade or counterfeit products that are the problem. But doctors are concerned about it all. So this is an acute injury to the lung that, as we know now, can be life-threatening. And because there's no smell, the parents may not even know their teens are vaping. Meg Farris, Eyewitness News. And symptoms of a health problem include shortness of breath, a cough, chest pain, and upset stomach.